Now, we know that desertification is caused by livestock, mostly cattle, sheep and goats, overgrazing the plants, okay, leaving the soil bare and giving off methane. Well, I have news for you. We were once just as certain that the world was flat. We were wrong then, and we are wrong again. What we had failed to understand was that the seasonal humidity environments of the world, the soil and the vegetation, developed with very large numbers of grazing animals. And that these grazing animals developed with ferocious pack hunting predators. Now, the main defense against pack hunting predators is to get into herds. And the larger the herd, the safer the individuals. Now, large herds dung and urinate all over their own food, and they have to keep moving. And it was that movement that prevented the overgrazing of plants, while the periodic trampling ensured good cover of the soil, as we see where a herd has passed. That soil is ready to hold, absorb and hold the rain, to store carbon, and to break down methane. When I first realized that we had no option as scientists but to use much vilified livestock to address climate change and desertification, okay, I was faced with a real dilemma. How were we to do it? I can think of almost nothing that offers more hope for our planet, for your children, and their children, and all of humanity. Thank you.